People of the interwebs. Okay, whoa. Hello, people of the webs. I'm gonna be working in a short film. Holy fuck, he's late, dude. Where's my thingy? I'm gonna be driving. I'm gonna go to Maple Ridge. A uh, short film for a friend of mine. Yeah, this is today. This is the next week. That was mean of me. I left you guys here for too long. As you guys know this is sound device at 633. I'm gonna rewire those guys. Labs. This is where I keep my batteries. You guys remember this for last week? Kind of chilly out today. I use these batteries. They're pretty good. This is my road shooter kit transmitter. This guy is like next level good. And the cool thing about this guy is that you can use this style of batteries too. These are uh, MP7. You can use this type of battery too on this transmitter. Just and you can use this guy for like a month. <laughs> I mean, the double is not that bad actually. But it's, it's nice to have the option to use different batteries. It's been through a lot of things actually. This guy and that the pouchy thing. I haven't actually found a purpose for the small one. All right, so let's rig this labs. I'm gonna clean my, my labs right now. My cables are getting pretty nasty. Cotton balls. And hand sanitizer. Put it in here, drips, drips, drips. And then you just go like that. I mean, this is kind of helping it. If you guys know of a better way to do this, let me know, please. Cause this is, I don't think this is ideal. This lab technique right here, the sandwich I use sometimes, it's not the best for every situation. That's what you have to be ready for. Why are you wearing boots for? I thought we were gonna get into a puddle. No, I have my boots. Okay, yeah, you can't use them. Good. So are they gonna be getting wet though? Those people? What's up? <laughs> so you think they're gonna be getting into water though? I don't wanna put my packs in. I don't think so. Okay. I don't, you know what? Actually, I don't think you're gonna need any packs for the first yeah. couple of things. Okay, just the boom? Yeah. Okay, cool. So yeah, this technique is not always really useful. Depends on the on the situation, right? That's why there's several laughing techniques. I want to get those Ryko undercovers. Have you guys heard of them? Have you used them? Let me know if they're good. I'm going to try them too, but I ordered them from Studio Economic. It's a store in Quebec, I think, Canada. That's where I got all my gear, pretty much, and True Audio. The thing I don't like about True Audio is that they don't, they don't have too much stock. You have to pre-order them, right? Okay, so let's get this ready. This is the sticky stuff. Old skin. Just do a little measurement here. I brought my like a brush. I have to take care of this guy. And I'm gonna use my boots good. Yeah. So, so you're gonna fake it? I need one. I need one. the black one. Cool. Cut. Hi, boys. Hey, you be cool. careful around those horses. Don't go behind them, whatever you do. Yeah. Baby. So, you want to buy my 5D? Oh. But it's a better, it's a better camera than that. Hey, buddy, how's it going? Huge, a huge bird. Let me see ya. Just finished here. Gonna go home. Cause tomorrow we gotta work again. So I'm gonna get all my things ready. Good morning, people. This is the fourth day in a row that I have to work this week. This guy has blessed us. I still need to finish that fully. Maybe tomorrow. I gotta get there, so I don't want to be distracted. I love you guys, but I'll see you guys in a bit, okay? Peace, peace. I'm gonna get to work. I don't know why this is happening to my LMB transmitter. My SMQB is nice and strong, nice signal, but this guy is it's gone. Let me know if you know how to fix this. I think I need to read the manual. Squill, most of y'all just sent me, but I've been in the field for you. It's real for you, right?
Take exit 11 to merge. Humans! Ooh, I like this thing. Okay, morning. Actually, it's not morning. I don't even know what it is anymore. I was sick. I didn't feel like recording. I'm sorry. Also, I got a few things I gotta say here. I'm gonna be uploading Saturdays, not Wednesdays. I'm gonna do the microphone comparison in two parts. Today is gonna be myself. I don't have anybody else to help me, so it's just gonna be myself. So next Saturday, I'm gonna have Madison. She's gonna be helping me. So you can hear how it sounds with a female and a male talent. And okay, let's get to it, okay? My friend is using his MKH-8050. I'm not gonna be able to compare that one. I'm sorry. I, I, shut up, I keep moving, but I can't because the light is right here. I'm gonna be using the Sheps, the MK-41, the Sennheiser MKH-50. And just to throw one other microphone, I'm gonna use the Sennheiser 416. So this is what's gonna happen here, okay? Hello, how's it going? This is gonna be the microphone comparison. I have all these microphones right now. I have the Sennheiser MKH-416. I have the Sennheiser MKH-50. I have the Sheps MK-41. I'm using the Rode Mic Pro in the camera, and I'm also wearing a lavalier. Uh, it's a Sanken Cos 11. Okay. And I'm not gonna be looking at the viewfinder. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm gonna be reading uh, the definition of sound, and then I'm just gonna swap throughout the microphones so I can actually make a comparison of how they sound. Okay. All right. So let's do this. Let's read this. So the definition of sound is vibrations that travel through the air or another medium that can be heard when they reach a person's or animal's ear. So the definition of sound is vibrations that travel through the air or another medium that can be heard when they reach a person's or animal's ear. So the definition of sound is vibrations that travel through the air or another medium that can be heard when they reach a person's or animal's ear. So the definition of sound is vibrations that travel through the air or another medium that can be heard when they reach a person's or animal's ear. So the definition of sound is vibrations that travel through the air or another medium that can be heard when they reach a person's or animal's ear. That's the sentence. <laughs> okay, now I'm just going to try and project a little more with all of them. So I'm just basically just going to scream as loud as... Not, not, not scream, but... And... Uh, hey! So for these ones, I got the mics really close to me and I'm using, I got a hard knee, a minus 16. What can I read? Something funny. Somebody's giving me a call, okay, one second. Hello? Hello, how's it going? Hey man, good. Oh, pretty good man, how you doing? Um, yeah, we've got a little shoot next Tuesday. I have four laughs. Yeah. Okay, cool. Are you guys gonna need a smart slate and lock it box? Alright. Should be fine. We'll be shooting red. I can do yeah. that, yeah, for sure. Okay, cool, good to have you on board. We'll have, we'll have some, it'll be fun. It's all comedy, so. So no explosions yeah. to this time, huh? You'll get a call sheet. So I'll just send you my email and a text and then I'll see you guys Tuesday then. Alright, so I gotta work. Work is always good. So this is what's gonna happen, okay? We, we Right now we hear a, like a little bus outside the my house. Also, you have to wear headphones for this. Come on, don't be weird. So the retail price for these microphones is the MK41 is a $2,200 microphone. Holy Moses. Did I spend that much? God damn it, I spent that much at all. $2,200, dude. God damn, that's an expensive microphone. Okay, so the MKH50 is a $1,400 microphone. The Sennheiser MKH416 is a $1,200 microphone. And the Cos11 it's a $500 microphone and the Rode Mic Pro is a $300 microphone. So, you know, I mean, they're for different things. I like them all. I don't own all of them. My friend Geraldo uh, lent me his MKH-50. I wanted to try also the MKH-8050, but my friend is working, so he's using it. Whenever I get a chance, I'm gonna compare that one too, so it's not in this video. Hello, people! People! I'm projecting a little more, so maybe you can hear the room a little better. I'm in uh, my living room. Hello, people. I'm projecting a little more so maybe you can hear the room a little better. I'm in uh, my living room. Hello, people. I'm projecting a little more so maybe you can hear the room a little better. I'm in uh, my living room. Hello, people. I'm projecting a little more so maybe you can hear the room a little better. I'm in uh, my living room. Hello, people. I'm projecting a little more so maybe you can hear the room a little better. I'm in uh, my living room. Hello, people. I don't know what else to say. I just feel like a crazy man right now. Hopefully this makes sense. I'm going to do another one downstairs in the garage. So it's a little bit more, more of a verbi situation. So it's going to sound different. And I'm all shiny here. Holy crap. <sighs> okay. So let's do this. Okay. 
So this is a more pervy room. Actually, this is a pretty nice test, actually. I'm really impressed. Like, oh, this is interesting. Anyways, I'm just gonna read the thing. Vibrations that travel through the air or another medium and can be heard when they reach a person's or animal's ear. Vibrations that travel through the air or another medium and can be heard when they reach a person's or animal's ear. Vibrations that travel through the air or another medium and can be heard when they reach a person's or animal's ear. Vibrations that travel through the air or another medium and can be heard when they reach a person's or animal's ear. Vibrations that travel through the air or another medium and can be heard when they reach a person's or animal's ear. Just check out this crazy echo, okay? Alright, so I'll see you guys next week, okay? This was the test. I don't know how it's gonna sound. Sounds pretty good though. These mics are great though. Damn, they're pretty good. Um, I'm just gonna I'm gonna do a quick silence so you guys can hear that. Alright. So that's it, man. Also, we haven't talked about the mystery sound. Last one, nobody guessed it. I think it was pretty hard. So for this week, mystery sound, it's gonna be... If you know what it is, let me know. I'm gonna try to make it easy this week, because last week, nobody guessed the sound. And you know, that's not fun, man. The only mic stands I ever use are k and M. I'm not gonna spend 30, 20 dollars on a mic stand when my microphone costs almost two grand. You know, it just doesn't make sense to me. It's like saying you're gonna buy cheap wheels on a Ferrari. It shouldn't make sense. All my cables are Neutrik. Get good cables too, man. See you guys next week. Take care. If you want to, share the love, like, subscribe, and all that, and peace. So yeah, this was the sound.